the recipe from one of my audience asking me to make the Jamaican festival. You know, Chef Ricardo can do everything, you know, remember where I'm coming from. So I want to share this with you guys today. And yeah, man, a good vibes because, you know, when time your audience asks you for something, you must always make it for them. And that's the beautiful thing about me. You know, if you guys ask me for something, definitely, you know, Chef Ricardo gonna make it. I got another recipe where someone asked me for about the okra punch. I need to make, make that one also. So, yeah. Well, please um, subscribe to the channel and leave your comments. And we're gonna show you how to do that one today. Alright, it's not gonna be something too complicated. It's gonna be easy and simple. Alright. Yeah, and Mary. Big up yourself. Thank you so much. It's gonna be a very simple recipe. Alright, now I make too much. I'm just gonna make a little bit. Alright. Now, Jamaican festival, you know that go with jerk chicken, jerk pork, jerk lamb. It is coming up to summer. A lot of people will be doing things in their back garden, and that's why I'm doing this one today. Okay? So first of all, let's start that. Chef Ricardo, Olipa, Lamb Tarkin. So we need to get one cup of plain flour. All right, this is a plain flour. All right, guys. One cup of plain flour. All right, I'm using a cup. Just to make you guys know what I'm going. Now, we got baking soda. Hear me, sorry, baking powder. Sorry guys, because I was using baking soda earlier. I got baking powder. So make sure you have that right down, all right? This is one and a half teaspoon inside of it, all right? Teaspoon, I'm using teaspoon. Lovely. Now, <laughs> all right. No worries, Every, that sounds good. You're gonna see my recipe, guys. Number one recipe. Now, um, so we got the, the, the flour, one cup of flour. Now we're gonna get some cornmeal. I'm gonna use half cups of fine cornmeal, all right, inside of it. Uh, we have to do it the right and proper way, all right, guys? Yeah. Um, most people don't use these things, but this is a tradition way. We're gonna put a pinch of Jamaican nut egg, not much, just a little pinch inside of it. That's a pinch, all right? We're not using too much of the Jamaican nut egg. And also, that's a little pinch of mixed spice, not too much, all right? That's a pinch. So a good vibes that one, all right? Then what we're gonna do, we're going to sieve it in. All right. The reason why I'm doing it this way, guys, it's gonna be light and nice and spongy. So you have to do it this way. Long time I'm not gonna want to update recipes on this audience request it, and I say, yeah, good vibes. We can make it for now because that's chef record, honey. Yeah. So once you start this up, all right. So what we're gonna do? We're gonna get two teaspoon of granulated sugar. Uh, so to go inside of it, all right? And then we got some sea salt. We're gonna put a pinch of sea salt. Because I don't have any measurement for the salt. So what we're gonna do? We're gonna get everything inside of it like this. So once you see it in, Trust me, a different vibe. So as you can see, sugar is going out. Still have a little bit of sugar left. All right, but. Yeah, that's pink salt. Yeah, man. But I only use pink salt, you know? Yeah, that looking nice. 
You know what I mean? But as I say, it's roughly about another teaspoon of sugar. So what we're gonna do? All right. We're gonna just put in a teaspoon of sugar in it. Cause you have to have some sugar. But I just put the sugar in it because I'm not using a bigger grid. If it was a bigger sieve, it would be much more easier. But still good if you have a bigger sieve. But that one is not a big one. So let's put this one side. All right, that, that one side. Where's my, oh here it is. So I got my measurement right here. So I'm gonna use some coconut milk all right and the coconut milk is from the fridge so we're gonna measure it coconut milk one cup you can use a regular milk but I'm using coconut milk yeah. vanilla I'm gonna put a teaspoon Vanilla, yeah. A little bit more. Nice one. Wicked. Now, some people put butter in it, but we're not using a butter on this one. If you like, you can put some butter in it, make it more soft and nice and a little bit crispy so we're gonna add some milk to it and take time mix it all right because i'm not making a lot neither a little bit more make sure you're using cold water or cold milk is more easier yeah Long time we're not going to update version, so just sit back and enjoy the flight. A little bit more. That looking really amazing. Some the real Jamaican way that you know your grandmother would be using water and just dash it in and but you know our modern days now you know things has changed you know it's not like 1962 a little bit more liquid so it doesn't take the whole cups of coconut milk but as you can see right. yeah that looking good. get it in the groove all right wanna see that yeah look at that so easy yeah. you guys can do the same thing don't be shy just don't tell yourself you can't do this look Smell the spices and everything inside of it. All right, so this looking good. So we're gonna make this rest for a few minutes. Gonna get the oil hot up and thing. You know what I mean? Yeah. So a good, a good vibes. Smell this, guys. Smell it. See that? Yeah. Look at that. You know, that's what you wanna see. Look good. All right, that's what you want to see. And I'm going to show you how to make it because a lot of people don't know how to make the Jamaican festival. All right. So what you want to do 
is cover it with something make it go on. I like I use plastic but I mean I got the napkin let's cover it and make it ear lock for a bit so I did not use the one of the one cups of milk as you can see I still have about a quarter left so it's the same thing for you guys Welcome to Jamaica, guys. Anyway, let's see what I go on. Um, all right. That seems tight. No, no, it's good, man. It's proper. All right. Over here, we got some oil getting hot in the meantime. So, what I'm going to do. All right, I'm going to just put a little piece in it like this and it will tell me when the oil is getting hot all right so i'm not using too much oil so you just want a little bit of oil rough about just a little bit to you know i mean you can fry both sides so i'm gonna show you exactly how to make it because that's important a lot of people don't know how to make the dough off they make the dough but they don't know how to make the dumpling to make it works the right way in it so a good vibes so over here as you can see it is getting hot it's perfect the dough is perfect all right no tight no nothing everything is good the chef recorder you're in class you just have to just listen to the teacher and then you will learn it's perfect with the liquid you just take a little time and add the liquid when you sieve it it's trust me all the year come out the flour and it's set free you know what i mean yeah so uh, that happened just take a little look as you can see you see look at that you see that nice all right so you just leave it and make it get a little bit of fresh air and you're good to go all right so if you want to make a coffee it or uh, you know turn on the big tv and you're gonna see what it look if you're if you're watching it on the tv Now, I have a recipe which I want to make, you know, I mean, tear up sheet to make and punch. All right, it's on a weekend drink. So, someone has requested that recipe. I'm gonna um, show them how to make that one. Yeah. So, a good vibes. All right. Maybe turn on over here, so. Yeah. So the oil I get hot. Alright, the oil I get hot guys. See that? We don't have much people upon life, but um you don't know people at work. You know what I mean? People busy. <laughs> what I want me that people people busy. People that do things. You know? That's so good. So as you can see, all right, it's, it's telling me when it's start, going to start to fry. So that's what I'm waiting for. Once it starts to fry, then we know so we are good to go. And we can start to roll up the dough and make up some dumpling and fry them off and everybody happy. You can make this in the summer with some jerk chicken. Trust me, the way I did it for you guys, you can't find this nowhere in the world except from Chef Ricardo. Yeah. So, if you follow my recipe, honestly, you can't go wrong. You know, this recipe is gonna be one of the bomb recipe them. You know what I mean with coconut milk in it and all them things. Something different. 
we have used coconut milk so you can see start to getting hot all right we just put a little piece in it to show you what i go on we could make them up and put them down one side we don't want the oil too hot neither let's come over here so get it down so you see look at this you see guys all right sonny look at this perfect when you're gonna make it guys and if you don't, don't use too much big piece that's a little piece some people do it this way all right but when you do it this way all right you need to flatter it out like this you know and make sure you squeeze the end them like this all right you see you wanna put them like this and make sure they end them flat just a little piece you don't want to make it too all right and flatter it out like this so you can see now let's come over here we're gonna put this in the in the aisle and we're gonna fry that one and show you just to make sure both of you guys are on the same track all right so as you guys can see don't stick in the pot and you're in a hot 100 percent yeah i was gonna use my little light frying pan but this one yeah Little one like that, and yeah. just flat that out a little bit. You don't want to get them too big, you know. Yeah, a good vibes. I was gonna use my other frying pan, but yeah, I just use this one, you know, because this one. Is the Dutchy? I like the Dutchy. Yeah, just wanna stretch them out a little bit. Chef Ricardo. Yeah. So we just like check it out for now one, yeah? Make sure everything's solid. Yeah, that looking good. A good vibes. Turn on the oil a little bit. And we don't want to have the oil too hot. Alright. Alright, enough people when they make it, you know, they, it's like the door it, it, it split up, bust up. You know what I mean? That's not the right way, guys. All right? So this one, as you can see. All right, nice one. Yeah. Yeah. So you can see, you know what I mean? Perfect. It's fried properly, man. Really nice. Oh, yeah. A good vibes. Look at that, nice. And it's simple, it doesn't complicate it. It's like one, two, three. Yeah. Yeah, perfect. Uh, it's like a perfect one. All right, now, see this one is nice and ready. All right. Put them on some napkin. A longer one. Oh yeah, chef, I gotta go for that one. Let me see what I got now. If don't fry, perfect. Look at that. You see? 
Ah, that's what I'm talking about. You see what I'm talking about, guys? Wow. So that's that's the checker. Let's check it. Mmm. Yeah. Perfect. Open it. Oh, yeah. You see that, guys? That is perfect. And this is a tester. It's time to fry properly now. Cause then there was a tester, you know. So we're ready for it now. Alright. Yeah. See them? Yeah man. Look at that. That's nice. Alright? to get the mixture right and that's the thing look guys look at this uh, that's perfect may I tell you this you can't get this no way for buy you have to make this at one. Honestly, if anybody wants this recipe, I can get the recipe for free. Plus, this recipe is one of the best. See, frying really nice, man. I told you the first one, let me know, is just a tester. I so say go when you're frying out them pine kind of island. Oh, yeah. Look at this. Even this one. You can't get them. You have to buy it, guys. You have to make this at work. You want a recipe, you get in touch with Chef Ricardo. Instagram. Jamaican festival guys, come on. This is Chef Ricardo. No.
make a nice color and then we're good to go but look at that so these are the long ones them you know Nice and lovely long one then. I've been making this for about 40 years now, man. So I know exactly what's going on. <laughs> you need them? Come for them right now, cuz. You know what I mean? Let's get a colour up on them, man. These are the, are the original Jamaican way. Because most people don't put the spice in them, you know, except Chef Ricardo. Yeah, as you can see. Look at that. You know, I mean, the wood bar. You know, simple and nice. Yeah. Nice one. Come over here. La la. What's going on? Here it is. Make sure when I get them right. Because, you know, I requested recipe, you know, I'm going to do it good. recipe you know exactly what to do okay big up yourself you just get to work all right work 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 oh yeah you have to pay the bills you have to pay the bills well, that's so it go all right bills have to pay work have to take place Tell me if you like it in the car. These are the best festival ever make in the world. I'm Chef Ricardo. All right. Trust me. I'm telling you guys, this recipe you were made, well, I shared with you now a while ago. La la. This is not for you today, no. Not until Christmas or Easter next year. Or Thanksgiving Day. You treat yourself, all right? Now, here it is, guys. Yeah, man, that's good vibes. Alright. So, you know, Chef Ricardo is in the kitchen. We do our best. I'm gonna make the last one. Yeah. Here it is. Oh, Thanksgiving, Christmas, Happy New Year's, Valentine. Jerk chicken, go down another pot. Queen of the Queen is in the building. Good night, Nicole. Oh, it's night for you over there. Nice to see you. Good night. All right. A good vibes. You hear them is? A good one. And then when I cook, turn on the heat a little bit. Good night, Nicole. Good morning. Or good evening. What time over there? Here it is. All right. Yeah, man, festival. A lot of people don't know if we met these. All right, look at this. 
And when they make it hard like a rock, you have to make it look soft like sponge, you know? Yeah. And you, you're, you know, a good vibes. You have to have it right. If you don't have it right, you're gonna be in trouble. I think this one can't come out. So you have to just get it right, you know what I mean? If you don't get it right, yeah, you're gonna be in trouble. But me, I always try to get it right, you know what I mean? But this, there's a secret in it, you know? To make it look like this kind of way. I turn off the heat, so I good vibes that. Secret is in it, guys, to make it. Secret is in it, and I turn off. Secret from Chef Ricardo to you guys. So if anyone watches our video today, you'll learn something new. The car. No, we're not doing that, guys. Alright, we're now gonna throw out with this one. This one have a lovely time in the pot for the last. You know, in a sego. Alright. So what we're gonna do now, we're gonna bait them in this thing. We're gonna bait them. I'm joking. <laughs> they finish guys. They are all finish. So take a good look at this. So I have them on a napkin. And I want you guys to see this right here. You cannot get this to buy in the local shop or your supermarket. You have to make these at home. All right, here it is. Uh, this is from Chef Ricardo to you. All right, big up on yourself. And if you don't need a recipe, contact Chef Ricardo and I give you the recipe for free. All right, look at this one. Even this, we are the tester. See? Soft and nice. And that's what they need, you know what I mean? See that? Soft and nice. And good vibes. Alright. Now, the message to you. Leave your comments and tell me exactly what kind of mistake I make. You know what I mean? Yes, man. I have the recipe for it. Okay? Leave your, your, um, your comments down below in the description box. And tell me what do you guys think about this and an amazing recipe come from just come from Jamaica and that's why I did it all right someone request the recipe and I just did it now I got a um, saltfish fritters which I want to make for you guys okay chef do you ever roast lobster um, no I never do roast lobster but I would love to do one let's say roast it in the oven I, I show you my oven, I don't even use my oven, guys. Honestly. This is, if I show you my oven, you'll be shocked. Still need to use. I don't even use it. Guys, I try my best. Okay, all right, I may have to try that one then. I may have to try that one. Yeah, but here it is. It's simple, guys. And when you make it, look at this. All right, you need it to be like this. You know what I mean? Soft and nice. You see when they're soft and nice? Yeah, they taste nice and lovely. But if you want the recipe, I have the recipe. You know what I mean? This recipe is a simple recipe. You know, I can just type it out to any one of you guys. Follow me. Instagram. Chef Ricardo cooking. And you know what I mean? Say Chef Ricardo, you like the festival recipe. I just type it for you. All right. A big one. This will be in my book next year. Because when the book come out, this is going to be in the book. Festival. All right. So look out for the book. It's coming very soon 2022 but the new book is released 2023 i mean the new book is released get the copy of this book to inspire you for the next book a good vibes love you know big up on yourself and have a great weekend man so anyway i got the next recipe to make but i may make that one probably tomorrow that one is a what do you call it tear up sheet yeah 
tear up shit only for weekends. All right, it's a requested video. Proper requested video. Anyway, have a good afternoon. I'll sooner, guys, later. Bye bye. Queen K, big up yourself. Happy New Year. Please follow me. Clicking the notification.